Ladies and gents, welcome to Prash Super Travels. As you can see, I am in absolute beautiful heaven. Where am I? I'm back home to Calanderno, North Wales. Now, I've just come from Blackpool. I needed to come here. I just needed to. I'll tell you why. This hotel, the, I can't pronounce it, the Travone. Here we go. The Travone. I got myself an absolute bargain on this place. But if you remember on my channel, normally when I get a good bargain, it doesn't always go the way that I want because it ends up being pretty damn bad. But don't forget, we are in Clandudno and I have good hopes for this place because I stayed at a few other places around here. So I know the areas, I know the people, I know what's good and what's bad. But this is the only place I can think of this week that I've not yet reviewed. And I have got some other plans to make more content here, more drone shots. But for now, I need to go and review the Travone. Have I got myself a bargain or am I going back down to hell? Mind you, this isn't Blackpool. So, mind you, I love Blackpool. Just want to clarify that. I love Blackpool, but some of the hotels there need a lot of help. That being said, it's time for Prash Super to go and review the Travone. Let's go. Okay, ladies and gents, here we are at the Travone Hotel, Clandudno, North Wales. I'm going to take you guys for a little trip around the hotel. You're going to have a look at the kind of rooms that they have here. We're going to do everything. We're going to check the beds. We're going to check the shower. We're going to check for mould. We're going to check everything, boy, because this is what we do. So first and foremost, the second I walked in, um, the second I walked in to check in, customer service was an absolute 10 really really impressed as soon as i walked in there was a lovely lady that opened the door and i said hi uh do you work here i'm just checking in the welcome when she started speaking i felt so much at ease and welcomed it to be here so that's a very good sign i then met philip so a big shout out to philip really really accommodating as soon as i walked in he said hello as well so um felicity and phil are both from Malta. Now it's one place that is on my list of places to go. Not yet been there. I do know people have been there and they absolutely love it. Mind you, the people of Malta, they're absolutely fantastic because this welcome was so sweet. I wish I would have got that on camera, but uh, they did say they don't want to be on camera. Not a problem. So I'm just going to carry on doing my job and uh, let's have a look around the hotel. Come on. Okay, so first and foremost, that's the uh, nice welcoming entrance. And you do have some mobility scooters, which is great. You can actually hide them here as well. And uh, yeah, beautiful sea view, absolutely unbelievable. And on this road, there is parking. After 4 p.m., it is free until around 9 or 10. I will confirm that on the left-hand side of here. I'll put a little thing up there. It's around 10 o'clock or 9. I'll just double check that and put it on there for you. Absolutely gorgeous garden. You can sit out here, listen to the waves. Caledonian travel, I can't wait to try them. Beautiful areas to sit, nice and clean, nice welcoming. Good start. So I will need to find out about the doors. Now I have been given my key. I've got room number 18, which we're gonna have a look at shortly. But as soon as you take a left here, you've got this beautiful lounge, would you call it, I'd say? I'll probably say lounge, yeah. Absolutely stunning, I love the red. The red is amazing. Look how clean it is, guys. Absolutely fantastic. In fact, I think we need to do a chair test, don't you? Oh, oh my God, that is super comfortable, guys. That is amazingly comfortable. Look at that. Nice big TV. You can watch a nice movie. So the good thing is they do have a lift as well. Uh, I think I'm on the second floor today. Beautiful reception. Look at that. I love these old, old style carpets, Makes reminds me of my grandma's house actually. Just look at that building, beautiful. Okay, breakfast prices, pretty decent. Large breakfast, 8.50 in Wales, that's actually really good. 
Mind you, it looks like it's a small and a large for the same price. Might as well go for a large. All these thank you cards. I don't know what's in there, it's probably stuff only, but um, yeah, let's carry on looking around. I was so, I felt so happy when I walked in because I can now see why they're getting thank you cards because of the fact the service is absolutely amazing. This is a nice spa area. At least you can come and see where you have your breakfast. Very nice. I love the cleanliness of it. I mean, not a bit of dirt in sight, no dust I can see. That's just perfect. Absolutely clean. Bar test. Nothing. Pure clean. That is amazing. Wow. Smallest, smallest lift ever. But number two. Do I hold the button in or do I let go? No, we're good. The safety curtain is fitted for your safety. If obstructed, the lift will stop once clear. Press destination button again. Okay, so that means just don't panic. We're good. Yep, there we go. Please do not stand in front of the black sensors. They are on each side of the lift entrance. Otherwise, they keep on singing and the lift will not move or stop automatically. Oof, do not panic, however. Right, room number 18. Oh, here we go. Room number 18, let's have a look. Okay, let's have a look. I like how they've done the towels, that's nice. Question is, how do they smell? Are they washed properly? Fresh, super fresh, if anything, very fresh indeed. Really amazing. All right, other facilities do we have? Oh, what's this room for? Is this like another room? There's no bag stand, so I've kind of just put my bag, plonked it over there. Enough hangers, just what I want to see, that's perfect. And you don't have to worry about that getting dusty because you've got a separate door, you can close that, keep your clothes nice and uh, dust free, very good. Not that there's any dust here, but. Okay, oh, this bathroom. Whoa, look at this. Wow. Definitely keeping on top of the cleanliness. Oh, they've even got, what does that say, conditioner and I'm guessing body and hair. What does it smell like? Hold on. Oh, that smells lovely. I love it. I'm loving it. Here we go. Let's have a look at the pressure. That's really good. That's really good pressure. This hotel, really good. I mean, even the curtains, clean. Obviously the windows are gonna be hard because of all the swans, uh, swans, uh, seagulls. Nice sea view. I'll be looking the small arm and on that side, you've got the pier and the great arm. Really small kettle. Let's put some lights on actually, we need some lights. Reception hours, 8 o'clock in the morning till 11 and 3 till 6.30. Not man 24 hours, okay. Breakfast, so they've got all the information here that you require. So you can't bring any alcohol into your room. But if they had a draft, I think that would be a really good idea to have draft beer. Welsh brew, decaf. Black tea, rich and fragrant, very nice. Oh, you got the biscuits as well. Oh, all the good stuff. Got the kettle, oh, they've got the water there, that's very useful. If anything can make this room any more perfect right now, a fridge, a small fridge. You can pick one up nowadays for between 30 and 40 pound, and this will increase a big value in the room. Trust me on this one. I've known a lot of other hotels 